Yeah, right. <laughs> no, cash cake, man. That's the best. Beats anything, I can. It's natural. It's just really good. We, 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 you know what I mean? We're so fortunate. We're in a really privileged position, and we, and we all realise that. Like I say, you know what I mean? We was all like plumbers and electricians and postmen and all, and labourers. And so to be, you know what I mean? It's almost like you know, without getting caught cool in that, it's like a dream come true. Do you know what I mean? People might say, you know, oh, you're jumping on the green bandwagon and that, but all the songs were written. Well, a lot of the songs were written before we even knew, you know, we was going to get any interest from anywhere. You know, let alone a big record company. We didn't. We, yeah, you know, we didn't know what was going. We were just doing it for fun. You know what I mean? Because we enjoyed doing it, and we still do. So the, the songs are written because, like I say, we all shared the same interest. It's like we, you know, it's hard for me to say if we didn't share that, what would happen? But because we do, do, you know what I mean? But I'm sure we'd be together somehow. If 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 we weren't doing this, we'd all be on the same building site, something like that. Do you know what I mean? The uh, the lead singer's here, so if you want to have a few words with him? You talk long enough to me. All right. See you later on. Shelby. Hello? Shelby? All right, mate. Yeah, it's John. How are you, man? All right. Well, we just, we just, you know, we, we're keen to sort of, we're keen to use recycle, recycle materials wherever we can. And, or like, not, not necessarily recycle, because that isn't always sort of like the best to use, like, but environmentally friendly packaging wherever we can. I mean, the more we go into it, the more we find that it's a lot, a lot bigger issue than we initially. I mean, initially we thought it was just a matter of using recycled paper for everything, and that was it. But it's not as simple as that by any means. It's like a lot bigger issue than that, and we're we're learning about that now. Do you know what I mean? Have you see, yesterday was a thing in the Daily Star, little oh. thing about about. Um, did you see it? No, I didn't heard of it. Had a green rock band, Natural Life, uh, on the campaign to get other artists. Yeah. Uh, Package this, that will find the way. Do you understand the whole campaign? Maybe John should tell you that. The only thing with, I mean, there's, there's so many people like, there's so many people like bandwagoning at the moment, do you know yeah. what I mean? The only thing we're really concerned about is keeping it really low profile, yeah. do you know what That's I mean? Right. But so, I do, yeah. Uh, yeah. I'd also be slightly worried about the word green. Yeah, yeah, yeah I, exactly. I, I know, that's right. Do you know yeah, what I mean? Yeah. Because the media are very keen on using it because it automatically boxes and, yeah. But in a sense, it's very difficult because it's kind of. It's an excuse, it's become an excuse for all sorts of things. And it's, exactly. As a word, the word has basically been hijacked for all the wrong reasons. A lot of people involved in this were doing it to make money, unfortunately. And they're not doing it because they believe in it. And it's beginning to screw things up rather badly. So you just have to take great care, because it's very easy to say, we've produced something called an environmental communications channel. Now that would be more important than it is today that the communications industry does not abuse the environment, whether directly or indirectly. The media do not merely communicate about the state of the environment, they can influence its reality for better or for worse. Sadly today there is a wave of misleading imagery which plays on concern for the environment. Environmental imagery is often linked to products or services that are in fact the spoilers of that environment. Consumer goods and processes that corrupt and poison the environment are depicted amidst natural purity. Species treasured among the last of their kind and uses motifs to promote products that hasten their destruction. So in a sense, what we're doing is we're trying to take on the people who use the environment for their own personal gain. Yeah. And say, look guys, you're not allowed to do this anymore because you're just pissing everyone off. You, you're aware of like, what we're doing then? I'm aware of what we're doing and I think it's absolutely great. I and mean, I just don't, I don't know whether you guys realise that, I mean, I'm always saying that there's no real public vehicle there's a lot of pressure producers, Greenpeace, as Friends of the Earth, as well, Wildlife. But there's nothing that people can independently of that, culturally, let's say, let's just call it culturally, can get involved in on the green, sustainable, 
sensible front. And I'm amazed that there hasn't been a band before, really. And I just wish you all the best. I managed to get a smile from the bloke with the long, dark hair who plays the guitar. Ah, I thought the keyboard player was gorgeous. Yeah. Yeah. Rachel Maxwell. Rachel Maxwell, yeah. Maxwell yeah. mate. Oh, See, it's personal. in Liverpool. I'm not personal, are you, mate? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Trish. Who's that then? Who's that then? Trish of Devon. Oh, right. Devon. 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 Devon because it has a strong environmental feel to it. I would like to use it as one of the songs that the choir will perform. Yeah. If my, my manager comes up and sees you eating in here, it, you don't bring your own food in, okay? All right. Right. You need to finish it anyway. So, uh, it's cool. Fucking 
She's giving it all that. No, I don't trust him. Fucking, I don't know what he'll do and all that. But you cheeky cunt. She's a piece of fucking lucky. Do you know what I mean? In my fucking room, in my fucking bed, my hotel, telling me she can't fucking trust me. Don't like it. Fucking sleep in the fucking bed. Cheeky cunt. Do you know what I mean? I'm sound asleep anyway. I'm gonna wake up for that. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> and then I've got to sleep all like this. We keys in me fucking you know, <laughs> that one when it's like digging on all that. Fucking big imperialist, man. Some of my best friends are back. Well off, mate. I'm not happy this morning, mate. I know that. It's half past two. Come on, we'll get we'll on it, Will. We'll have an hour in Blackpool. It takes an hour. Four o'clock. Oh, yeah. Oh, we'll be in Blackpool. Let me call the black. Uh, call the black side. Because it'll be back. summary of accounts is it Chris? This is just like got fucking general headings and fucking and like big figures. It's not an item I summary of accounts is it? I don't see what's ludicrous. Why couldn't he have made that phone call the night after we had a meeting a month ago? Man, but this is what they've come up because with. he had it written out. It was all written this, out in his logbook. It wasn't written had. out. It wasn't put in his computer. This is what we had a month ago, isn't it? But tight instead of handwritten. No, no, it's this, more is more more this, out. Out. this isn't like this isn't what we asked for. Well, it's what you're going to, this is the first stage of what you're going to get from an accountant. This you isn't understand? an itemised summary, you want the whole this thing isn't item. an summary of accounts, right, yeah. and that is what we asked for four months ago, maybe. Well, it... Uh, no, listen, right, an item, this is like a general summary of an account, right? Is, How yeah. am I telling you, a manager, what, this is a, a general summary is. of an account, right? What we asked you for, did we or did, you, did we not ask you for an itemised summary of accounts? So this yeah, point. we did. But you were, right. John, I've got to say something. You were asked if you wanted to go in and have a look at it all, and you could have done it. You didn't want no, to go in. What, no, listen, what we wanted was an itemised summary well, of account. Well, we're going to get it. As soon as Darius calls me back, we'll get it, OK? All right, but, like, okay. so, like, this is what we asked but for. you could have gone this is in what and we, seen it. This is what we... We had this meet, meeting... But like, you could like have gone in and three, seen it, and yeah, you wouldn't go in and see before. it. That's what we fucking pay for, mate. That's what we pay for. We pay well, for we'll 12 hours a minute, then, won't we? Right, don't fucking give it all no, that. Why don't you give it to me, okay? Well, we've asked I'm you sick of 
your right? fucking attitude, we've, man. We've asked for things, right? And we haven't had them served. This is fucking rubbish. This is fucking... It's not fucking toilet rubbish. Toilet Stop paper, being so bloody rude. Stop on... calling it fucking toilet paper, John. Stop calling it written. toilet paper. This is what was written. It's not an item of summary. It's not an item of summary, but Cas, but we'll get right, it later on, okay? For, right? yeah. Until that's served up, then you, you haven't done your job, mate. Yes, we have done our fucking job. Wait! You might know this one. This is Strange World. a time man we haven't got the time man you know what i mean there's a hole there's, uh, there's a big ozone hole over paris the size of paris there's one over london probably but they're not telling us about it you know what i mean if we don't do things now the contract says we have to do our best endeavors i felt that you know uh, we had done our best endeavors and i felt that at this moment in time in 1992 in april 1992 to put an album out by a brand new band in cardboard packaging is going to cause, uh, is going to put us at a disadvantage. I have to be careful. I have to take into account retailers' opinions, salespeople's opinions. You have to make sure you get it right. And we should do what, what I think we suggested is a good thing. And when, and when we meet once a week, we do a note to all of you, and we take it from there. And when we are ready to change it, we are ready to change it. If you want to limit it to, you know, 8,000 or 20,000, we are, you know, I'm just being practical about it. Let's yeah. say we put the album out and it's a runaway success. And three weeks from now we need to reorder 5,000 
uh, CDs. And we're not ready with this new packaging. What do you want me to do? Not, not order them? Not sell them? I can't. It's all going very, very well. Next thing we're just talking about that at the moment. Probably passion. Yeah. Okay. See you soon. That's the one we're going to go with. Let's get a barn stuff. You see, do you hear the, ch the change between the boat? What would be in there is like, it'd be a bit more like, it'd go Same into the second other. verse and, and like, and as it was, like the other one. We thought was. the original one was like, <laughs> dropped out like a cable out of the piano bit. So that's what we're going with? No, but there's, they're mixing. Well, it's got to be really, it's got to yeah, be the, the mix. It's got to be, we're going to recall the mix. The guitar's up more, a bit more in your face than that. Anyway, the only problem was the, the bit between the, the first two verses. Like, there's a break between there. I think, like, what, the way it's been changed now, I think that problem's sort of, like, sorted, really. It's a bit squeaky clean. Yeah, who's doing the mix? Well, that was, uh, see, I mean, it's like a very, you see, when we do it live, it's like a really heavy guitar song, do you know what I mean? And it sort of, it, be, it just so be, can I just get somebody to mix it like we did with the last one? No. Uh, no, we do it, we're going to do it ourselves. Do you think it needs another mix, then? I think it helped us definitely with Natural Life. After all that debate and discussion, we got a couple of great mixes out of Natural Life because we did it that way. When we, when we put a single out, I want to make sure that I feel we've done the best possible job on that record. Yeah. And I just haven't felt that yet on, uh, on, on Passion. That is the first priority. I mean, it's much more important to me than videos or anything, you know, the I record mean, itself. You, love you can get on that. Yeah. <laughs> the videos, you know, the record itself has to be the best possible one we can release. Yeah. Ah.
try to make us And if they don't, they break us And if they don't, they fill us with their lies And with their false solutions Yeah, yeah, yeah It's the end of the nation The flame of celebration But right within the souls of those who know We one day find our resolution Yeah, yeah Shop. lights before and it was like really bright on stage and it makes you feel right fucking right naked you know what <laughs> i mean it's like really bright so it's like that, that sort of and my voice was a bit tired so i was like right fucking keeping it like i was I had to concentrate all the way through do you know what i mean when my voice was tired but everyone's been fucking raving about it mate so we can please with it man well we knew it was like we knew it was the last one and that as soon as it come off and that i was just all the tiredness for the last month I just wanted to go home, I had to kill him, everyone went down the album, you know, I was just like off the bed, mate, plotted up. Yeah, I know. What can we do, mate? Good gig, though. Good gig like that. Yeah, Or with the with the bongos or with the backwards thing? Uh, uh, the bongos, I think, isn't it? I like a backwards thing. Try it, man. Yeah. Let's try some few different. Well, we should try, yeah. One with a backwards thing, one with the bongos, one with the a cappella, and then the bongos. When I told them about the a cappella idea, they were amazed. Get with the guitar and that, you know what I mean? Just that to build it right at this beat. This bit to make it pink. Bring them, leave them, con leave them bongos up and it helps it, helps it right along. It's good. <laughs> yeah, people are going to get very really emotional. You can hear them like they're sitting better in there, in there now, do you know what I mean? Well, they're just up that tiny fraction, do you know what I mean? They're like coming out over the top. Yeah, it's riding, isn't it? Yeah, it's good. Bit. You want one more? You got to do three in a row, mate. Three in a row, come on. Oh, yeah. Going past sleepage time, mate. What are you fucking complaining about, then? This is what you live for, anyway, man. Come on. Oh, I couldn't live on this fucking doing this every morning, man. Drive me crackers. This is what you live for. This is your finest hour, sis. <laughs> 
Yeah, it's half six. Morning. Good morning from the boys. Morning. Morning. There you go. No, we're still like doing the, still mixing. Is it? There you go. Here's your wake-up call. All right. What time are we going to be back? Sure. Yeah. All right, we'll see you then. Lady Muck kept a silver vibrator. Die charity cheat hid kinky life from her tough pals. A load of bollocks. Take this one, Will, have you? That's 
So we're just going to roll again and get a bit of chat there into, into natural life. Here we go. This is NJ Williams at the Hot FM. We have with us here today Natural Life. They're doing a session for this evening. Yeah, good to have you here. Guys. As you can tell, they've been working far too hard because they've just gone to sleep there. Uh, John's the front man here because you can never shut him up. Uh, John, Natural Life, of course, was a single. We we played loads. Was it disappointing that it wasn't more of a chart success? I know we've talked about this a bit. Nah, not at all. I, I mean, like we sort of we don't we don't rate we don't rate our success with, by 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 chart positions. Do you mm. know what I mean? If we did, I think we'd be like you know I mean, you'd, you'd be up and down all the time, like, listening to the charts. Well, we just we just like touring. We're, we're a live band, and like when we're going back to places now and playing, like I said, you see the reaction that we're getting. It's really good, and that's that's the way. That's, that's payback time for us. Do you know what I mean? It doesn't take much to guess that the album is called... Natural Life! Life. Yeah, it's in your shops. And yeah. it's in your shops now. <laughs> CD album and cassette. And all that sort of stuff. The most music. Most music. Guaranteed. Horizon Radio by the 3.3. And Natural Life here in session tonight. Yes. And still, and still alive. Hey, um, uh, it doesn't take much to guess that the album is called Natural, Natural Life. Life. And it's in your shops now. CD, <laughs> album, and cassette, and all that sort of stuff. Es geht um Natural Life. Es geht um Natural Life. Vielen Dank. Steffi von Hollywood Records. Fine. What's, what's the reaction been so far to the album? I mean, how's it selling at the moment on the road? Yeah. Yeah, 48 in our price, yeah. But with the midweek of 91, that's pretty, that's pretty weak, really. 
Oh, we've really got to get it into the top 75 for week one. Absolutely, definitely. I mean, obviously, we, previously, we, on the singles, it's sold on Fridays and Saturdays anyway, so I'm sure we'll be in there. But uh, 91 is a, a little bit disheartening at this point. It's, it's all true because you know the way the press are, they kind of latch onto something and then there's... No, we're right in the middle of, actually it's like, we're right in the middle of like, um, trying to establish a new format for CD packaging and we're like right up against it. So, so it's, it's very, very re relevant at the moment. So what's the new, what would the new format be? Well, just like we're trying to get it in like, there's this, uh, there's this eco package called, there's this paper called eco package and it's like 80% sure? recycled. recycled. Are we ready to roll? Yeah. How are you going to feel when people maybe start making a criticism that um, that you're hypocrites in the sense that you've got sort of the trappings of success and yet you still sort of maintain your philosophy about a natural life? Well, I think I think all you can do at the end of the day, if you if you believe it, if you believe in yourself enough, then it, it's never going to affect you. Whatever, whatever people say, it's not going to bother you. Do you know what I mean? Because if you if you know yourself and if you believe in yourself, then it doesn't matter what other people think. And I think that uh, if we're, we're ever to start behaving like in a hypocritical, if we were to start, I don't know, burning plastic at the end of our gardens, you know what I mean? Then we would lose what natural life is about, do you know what I mean? Because there's that, there is that strong, there's that strong like natural element in the band. But uh, let me think of what I'm going to say here. We came up with a name. It's like uh, we're not going. We're not saying like we live a natural life and everyone should like follow us and we're setting the perfect example because we're not. But it's something that we're aiming for, do you know what I mean? We're all trying to like to head in the right direction. And we feel very strongly about the environment as as sort of as songs reflect that and like the name of the band. But most of all it's like when, when people ask us about the name and we say, you know, like we do care about the environment and that. But one of the most important things to us about life is to have fun. You know what I mean? We don't believe there's there's, there's not enough people living to have fun, do you know what I mean? It's all like everyone's like that, do you know what I mean? So that's it's not, ex it's not only like, just like, well, we've got to care about the environment and we've got to care about this and we've got to care about that and you're not doing it. It's nothing like, it's just like, everyone just ease up a little bit, do you know what I mean? Yeah. Put a smile back on your face, you know what I mean? Go out and have a laugh, have a good time, man. I can't affect how people make cars, right? But we're involved in the, we're involved in the music business, you know what I mean? So we can try and affect that, do you know what I mean? And what we want to do is set a new standard. I mean, it's like, we do, we're no one at the moment, we've got no power at all, do you know what I mean? So it's very difficult, it's an uphill struggle for us. But we're trying to package our stuff in, like, environmentally friendly packaging. And at first we just wanted to do recycle, do it in recycle, but as we started researching it, we found that sometimes recycled material has more environmental impact than, like, using virgin paper. So the more we research it, the more we know, and pretty soon we're going to, like, we're going to be on everyone's doorsteps. The phone in every like record company side giving it to me. <laughs> 